she needs a fucking exorcism. It was then I knew I had to watch it. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Ant. Basically, if you're if you're new around these parts, basically all I do is play in makeup. I shop too much and I'm awkward as fuck. Sometimes you might catch me talking a little bit of shit. And if you're interested in any of those things, feel free to hit that subscribe button and join this beautiful ass gang. Because who wouldn't want to be a beautiful ass person? Help me figure it out. I don't know. And if you are a returning subscriber, hey boo. So as the title already says, I'm basically going to be installing a she and wig made out of possibly human hair. We all know. We never really know. At least I don't anyway. And... <laughs> Yo, Euphoria, bro. Let's get let's get started with the wig first. So this is the one I got. I don't recall the dimensions because I don't. But I'll flash it on the screen somewhere so you'll be able to know and see what I'm talking about. This is the wig right here. Got a lot of body. I was very very hesitant because. It's Shein, right? Who who wouldn't be a little bit suspicious about buying a wig from Shein? But I got this wig and it said it was, um, damn, bitch, we don't remember nothing about this wig. I really just remember ordering it. That's, that's it. I saw it on the mannequin head. I said, ooh, that's cute. I want it. I bought it. And it looks, it's, it looked like, it looked way better than any of the other wigs that I bought off there. So I, that looked really synthetic and really fake and plasticky and all that stuff. But this one, I was like, I wonder if it is human hair. Here is the inside of the wig. We got a pretty good lighting right here. And I would consider it a pretty good amount of pre-plucking going on. So, okay, get her. It feels really soft. It's got a lot of... It smells like a wig. Feels like a wig. And I can't... I don't know, something about this wig just made me go, I gotta have it. There's no like parting in it or anything like that, so you can't really do as much versatility with it. You could just really wear it and call it a day. But that's fine. Some days I wanna, I wanna, I wanna fro and go. And my hair's too long and I'm not cutting it. So this is also another reason why I got it. I'm gonna try and put, gosh, darn it, man. These clips ain't shit. I'm just saying that because I personally struggle. That's all. No real reason. Okay. So, I mean, I think it's got a pretty good amount of density in it. It's pretty thick for my liking. And I feel like it'll be really easy to just manage and take care of, add some water, some mousse and go, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up all of this hair that I got going on right now into a... wig cap. That took way longer than it needed to. I'm staring right at the damn thing and it's still in its packaging. I couldn't remember what it was called. Oh my god. This cap feels mad loose on my dome. It's slipping and it's sliding everywhere. Okay, so now that we got the wig cap on, um, I'm actually gonna go and try and find um i gotta find my lace spray i can't find it anywhere so give me a give me a minute god damn. i can't find the spray so i'm just gonna be using this black opal in black walnut and i'm just gonna dab that all over my head okay so i'm not gonna lie one of the main reasons why i'm doing this is obviously to review the Shein wig. It's not really a review. I just want to do it and put it on film, whatever. But um, I'm also doing it because I need a break, man. I need a mental break. I got, TikTok basically pressured me into watching Euphoria. I don't regret it, but um, I thought the grassy was bad. No, ma'am. No, 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 no. This show is so bad. Not bad in like a really, oh, I can't, it's horrible to watch kind of bad. Bad and like, there's just so much drama going on. There's there's a lot of any inappropriate activities going on amongst high schoolers. And a lot, I know for a lot of people that, you know, will turn you off from watching the show simply because these are high schoolers. And 
I know I'm, I'm coming off probably a little weird, very prudish, very grandma-ish when I talk about it that way, but hear me out. There's a lot of sexual activity going on in this program, far more than my liking, okay? And then you have it thrown in your face that these are high schoolers. Minors, bro. We don't need to watch that. We don't need to watch that. Mm -mm. No, no, we don't. Mm, look at that, that little foundation stick did pretty darn good. I'd say better than the spray. Missed a spot. And it's just, it's, it's a lot. So I wasn't going to initially watch Euphoria simply because I had heard from such and such who said that such and such was going down on this Euphoria show. And I was like, I'm not interested in that. I don't, I don't care to watch any of that. You know, I'll just, I'll politely pass. But TikTok was like, all these memes were coming up and then there's this guy in particular who plays out the scene. So good. Watch. Who said Nate was a bad person? Rue? It doesn't matter. Cause if we want to talk about people, let's talk about Rue. Rue's a good girl. And I'm not? I didn't say you're not a good girl. Rue's had a very hard life. Not harder than my life or Lexi's life. It's different. Right. Her dad died and ours just stopped calling. I don't know which is worse. And if you were such a fucking loser with no self-respect, you'd drop her because she treats you like shit. Enough. Enough. What? I can't say it to her, but you two can say it to me? I never said you didn't have any self-respect. You don't have to. I can fucking feel it. Oh, she needs a fucking exorcism. It was then I knew. I had to watch it. The first season, it took me a really long time because the episodes are really long too, I didn't notice. They're damn near fucking movie length long. I didn't realize, this is gonna take me so much longer because I just realized I have to do the wig cap itself. So I'll be doing two. So fun. I don't have a mannequin head either. Holy hell, man. So there's a lot of drama going on on this show. And then on top of the drama that's going on in the show, you got the uh, minors doing adult stuff on this show. And they show it all. All of it. All of it. But once you get past all of that, you start to see the show for what it is. At least for me anyway. Once the, I, I, I skip through all the fucking scenes because it's like, good God, man, another one. You don't need that many scenes in order to make a good show, you know? Okay, let's, 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 let's start with that. Let's start with that right there. And I'm honestly still trying to figure out why everyone hates Cassie. Like, I haven't gotten to that scene yet, but, um, why does everybody hate Cassie so much? Other than she's just really annoying. I don't even remember what I was saying. I'm getting really frustrated with patting down this wig with this foundation. It's taking forever. And you're probably not at the best angle to really see what I'm doing anyway. So give me a second. Better. But yeah, so that's all I really got to say that's bad about the show. But I tell you, man, this Nate character, oh my freaking god. When he got his ass, when he got his oh. He needs some milk. I've never been so happy in my life. I'm not gonna lie. I can't stand that motherfucker. I cannot. He's a <laughs> pile. Ugh. Ugh. He is clearly one of those people who gets by off of his looks and his parents' money. Look at that. Look at that. I actually kind of like it. <laughs> I, I kind of, I kind of really like it like it a lot like the cap room in here is really good i know i know we were just talking about euphoria you now we're talking about this wig the room in here the room on this wig is actually really nice i like it i like her wow she in well you know what let me finish doing an end the install on this before i get too too pressed too hype about it hello stranger Baby, I 
Okay, since we already went through all of that little short install, if you even want to call it that, can I just suggest never using a stick foundation ever again? Ever. I was gonna make a TikTok for this, but I decided not to. Do I decide? Or did we just forget? Yeah, let's be honest. I forgot. I'm gonna spray some water on this. Did I had to I had to stop watching that show. I had to, I needed a break. I'm on season two now. I think I'm on the second episode of season two. And I had to tell myself, hey Aunt, um, take a break. Take a break. Just because there's so much going on in that show. So here we are, we're doing this. We're doing this good stuff. I don't know, I was trying to describe it to my, uh, the bestie and the best way that I could describe it was like Degrassi on steroids. Cause Degrassi had its, 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 Degrassi had its moments too, to where you were like, what? And Degrassi came out when I was not in high school. No, I was in high school. But I was like, yo, their high school is wildin'. Like, they got too much going on. I'm glad my high school ain't like, this bad. I mean, my high school was pretty bad. Like, it was, it was pretty bad. But it wasn't a grassy bad. If, the reason why I also started watching Euphoria was because it does have a lot of real life issues in it. I'm gonna add moose now. And as dramatized as it is, and as over exaggerated as some of us feel as viewers, some viewers watching it, there are people who very well could be going through a lot of this stuff in high school. I knew a couple of people who had had shmushmortions and they were in high school. There were a lot of people at my high school doing drugs, I'll just say that. Did I participate? No, because I was too much of a wuss puss. I was, I was a little scurdy kid. Oh my God, this is coming out so stinking cute. I like her, I like her a lot. It makes me really want to do something with my hair like this though. I'm not going to. So I started watching it just, just for that, just to try and take that part in because there are people who are, like I said, going through a lot of that stuff like that. Um, it deals with more than just drugs and underage relations, which turns a lot of people off, understandably and rightfully so. I don't know. I want to say it's a good show. At the same time, I want to say it's a trash show. Am I going to stop watching it? Probably not. I'm too invested. I've already made it to the second season and I want to see what all these memes people are making on TikTok are about. Oof. I'm not going to lie. I didn't wash this wig. I didn't wash it. I got a little bit of shedding. Hold on. I got a little bit of shedding going on from the wig, but it's nothing like, like I've had worse shedding from other wigs. So far my favorite character isn't Rue, surprisingly. She gets on my nerves a lot. <laughs> she gets on my nerves a lot for being the main the main uh, character. And to be honest, a lot of the characters actually get on my nerves. Nate gets on my nerves. Nate, 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 Nate. Oh my God, Nate. That motherfucker could just fall off a cliff and I wouldn't care at all. Don't care for him. Don't care for Maddie. Don't care for Cassie. Don't care. <laughs> I care for Kat. Kat's prick. Kat, I, I, I see you. I hear you, boo. Jules. She gets on my nerves too, but at least I like her. I'm hoping that the, because it's the second season and I'm not caught up as much as everybody else. Oh my God. <laughs> I got a big forehead, so don't. Ugh. This glue is nice though. This wig, I tell you, she's pretty neat. She is pretty freaking neat. I don't know, man. You tell me what you think about that show because I'm just, I'm just all over the place. That's ugly. That's ugly. That's an ugly. These are ugly. <laughs> These are ugly little baby hairs that I'm putting on my face. Ignore them. They don't exist. They're going to be covered up anyway. Kind of, sort of, not really. Oh my God, those are hideous. Why do you do this, aunt? Why do you do this to yourself? I don't know. I don't know. I just do. I want to be pretty. I want to be cute. <laughs> I'm probably going to go back and watch, continue watching where I was and this most likely play GTA. <laughs> this is a very real possibility. I very much, there. the chances of me going back and, and watching that show, just to finish it and get it out of the way, to be honest. Like, I'm, like I said, I'm too deep to not 
not watch it anymore. I'm like that with a lot of shows though. Like I have to finish watching it even if I think that it's a horrible show or a horrible anime. I'm like, well, I already started it, so I gotta finish it. Okay, so this is the swig. It's not bad, it's not bad, not bad at all. This is so cute. Let me know what you think about this wig. I think it's so cute, especially coming from Shein. I think it's really soft, aside from, about, from all the shedding. It's really cute. I like it. That lace is really transfer. Like, I'm sure you can probably see it now because you're all up in my business right now. But like from here, straight from the scalp, baby. Okay, so my thoughts for this wig. It is obviously friggin' cute. And it's really, really soft actually. For it being only, I think it was $89. I'll correct myself later if I'm wrong. But for it really only being $89, this is really soft. And I love the curl pattern and I love how full it is. It's so soft. It's so bouncy. I love it. Um, I didn't wash it. Probably should have, but uh, you know, wig 101, lace 101. I didn't. It's, it's so soft and I, I can't wait to style it and dress it up with this. Oh my God, oh my God. So one thing that I got so far that I figured I could do, this headband. Look at that, your girl is cute and ready to go. And I'm just as ready to go without it too. Like, oh my gosh, I can't stop touching it. And it's so easy to style and get ready. It's, uh I'm very surprised. I'm very surprised this wig was even from Shein. Like, I was expecting Party City and I actually got a pretty decent wig. Very, very happy. Very happy girl over here. Look at it. Did you see? She moves. Oh, she's so soft. And she's gonna be so, I'm, I'm, I'm glad I got us a, uh, a shorter wig too because my long ones, when I don't feel like taking them off at night, but with my long ones, it's a pain because I, I gotta wrap all that up in my bonnet and then I gotta like do, take it out and comb it and stuff like that. And I feel like with this one, I could just throw my bonnet on and just go to bed and be comfortable and be fine with it. I wasn't actually going to put the little melt me down lace holding spray on there, but I did anyway. And now it doesn't bother me and I don't regret doing that at all because I can literally just throw my bonnet on and go to bed, which is most likely the plan tonight. Cause I got, I got a break, man. Like I said, I got a break. But yeah, I think that's all I gotta say about this piece right now. I'm definitely, probably, most likely, definitely, definitely, definitely going to go back on the site and try and get a different one too because they have so many on their website that, I mean, I, this can't be the only good one on there. This can't be. It's sh short wig summer, baby. Bob it up, bob it up, boo. Yeah, I don't know. I just felt like I come on here and I just do a little quick wig install from Shein and do my little my little freestyle conversations that I'm so good at. <sighs> And just talk a little about Euphoria. Like I had more ranting to do, but I'm pretty sure if you've seen the show, you, you, you've heard enough. You've heard enough. Anywho, you wonderful, beautiful ass, beautiful ass individuals. This is gonna be it for this video. I really do hope you like this wig. I really like this wig, especially um, it being from Shein of all places, okay. I'm very weary of spending money on wigs, mainly because when I do spend a lot of money on wigs and they look like they're really good, like they look like, like they like like you know what I mean like they look they look they look like a steal of a deal is what I'm trying to say because I can't can talk right now oh my god and then you get them and they look like clown wigs but this one I'm very happy and very pleased that it came out really really good I'm gonna get that strand because it bothers me oh yeah that's all I really wanted to talk about I just wanted to you know do my little my little two cents on Euphoria, which really wasn't that much, to be honest. Like it was just me talking about what characters I like with little explanation. <laughs> Pretty bad. But I do like this wig though, so that's a win. Anyways, if you like this video, go ahead and let me know you like this video by hitting that like button. Hit it, go ahead, punch that beat. Go ahead and hit that notification button and subscribe if you're new for better videos than this. <laughs> in my past and in the future. You hit that notification bell so you'll know whenever I post. This is so good. Comment your thoughts on the show or the swig. Go ahead. Let me find out about it, boo. God, roll-ups are so freaking good. Anyways, I'll catch you next time, boo. Bye.